At the World Defense Show, WDS, 2024 in Saudi Arabia, one innovation captured our attention, the Phasa 35. Designed by Prismatic Limited, a subsidiary of BAE Systems, this ultralight, solar-powered unmanned aerial system, UAS, represents a breakthrough in high-altitude pseudo-satellite, HAPS, technology. The WDS 2024, held in Saudi Arabia, is the perfect event to spotlight technologies like the Phasa 35. This global defense expo serves as a showcase for the latest innovations and developments in the field of international security, bringing together decision-makers, experts, and industry professionals. The Phasa 35 stands out for its ability to offer a flexible and economical alternative to conventional detection and communication systems. Thanks to its design, which incorporates advanced composites, optimized energy management, and photovoltaic cells, the Phasa 35 can sustain prolonged flight, both day and night. Solar panels provide the necessary energy during the day, while energy is stored in rechargeable cells for night flight. Capable of flying at altitudes above 66,000 feet, this drone completed a stratospheric test flight in June 2023 demonstrating its ability to operate above conventional weather conditions and air traffic. Weighing the same as a standard motorcycle, 150 kilograms, and with a wingspan of 35 meters, the Phasa 35 completed its maiden flight in 2020, just two years after its initial design phase. The major advantage of the Phasa 35 lies in its ability to provide a stable and persistent platform for monitoring, communication, and security. It can be connected to other technologies and assets, thus offering military and commercial customers unprecedented capabilities, from 5G communication to disaster management and border protection, all at a fraction of the cost of conventional satellites. The Phase of 35 represents a solution promising persistence, low operational consumption, and global deployment flexibility. Its potential applications are vast, covering military communications and surveillance, civil and maritime security, earth observation, environmental monitoring, and agricultural tracking. What surprised us most was the size of the device. For obvious reasons, only the head of this UAV was shown to us during WDS 2024. The arrival of the Phase 35 at WDS 2024 underscores once again the importance of innovation in maintaining global security and defense, offering new perspectives for the future of surveillance and communication.